SpaceX, this is Dragon on the big loop, 6.6, 4.400, hatch is open. We copy, hatch open, great to hear. And as you can see, they do have that hatch open now. They called down that came right at 12.02 a.m. Central Time. Hatch is between the two vehicle open. Now we're just waiting for the crew to uh, head to the International Space Station. Looks like they are waving hello to their new crewmates now. Also seeing here for the first time tonight, the uh, Roscosmos members of the crew, Sergei Ryzhikov, who is the commander of Expedition 64, and Sergei Kuzverchkov. And Houston, this is Dragon on the big loop. IMV duck installation is complete. You are go for IMV fan activation. Houston copies. Crew finishing up some intra-module uh, inter ventilation uh, work there, getting a uh, air flowing between the space station and the crew dragon before they uh, do make their way across the hatch. But again, that hatch is open now. That came at 12.02 a.m. Central Time. As I was saying a moment ago, this will be uh, Mike Hopkins' second visit to the International Space Station. He was last there in 2014. Same for Shannon Walker. She was there in 2010 for Expedition 24 and 25 and spent 163 days on board the space station. Suichi Noguchi has been to the space station twice before for STS-114 in 2005 and in 2009 for Expedition 22 and 23. He's got 177 days already in space. But this will be the first time for Victor Glover to pass across the hatch and visit the International Space Station, kicking off their months-long stay in space when the uh, space station will, for the first time, have seven crew members on board for a full expedition.
Station Houston on Space Ground 2, you are go in step 6.3. And Houston from Dragon, was that a go for us to continue? You are correct, Hopper. That's your go in step six, decimal three. Copy inward. Crew one crew members are working on a few final activities inside the Crew Dragon before they do make their way to the International Space Station. Making sure any loose items are stowed securely and then also putting away the uh, liquid uh, lyo cartridges that uh, they use to scrub carbon dioxide out of the air while they're on their way to the space station. Now that they now that they are at the space station, they don't need those any longer because they'll use the uh, space station system for that. Again, these are just the last few items before they'll be able to ingress the space station. Six Dragon on, on the big loop for Lyo. SpaceX here. Yeah, just a question. Uh, just want to confirm that you are supposed to put Lyo Cartridge 1, our original cartridge, into the active slot. That is affirmed. That is what we want you to do, please. Okay, thanks. And just so you know, we've got the echo. Copy. Shannon Walker there reporting down to the ground on the crew members' progress. Again, walking through just a few final items before they come on board the International Space Station for the first time on this mission. Again, they're putting away some lithium hydroxide canisters that uh, were used to scrub carbon dioxide out of the crew members' air. No longer needed now that the Dragon is at the International Space Station.
seeing two thirds of the uh, current Expedition 64 crew here. Uh, Kate Rubens, of course, with NASA, and then the Expedition Commander, Sergei Ryzhikov, there on the right side of the screen. They, along with Sergei Kuzbirchkov, have all been at the space station since October 14th. Now waiting to greet the four new members of the expedition that uh, will be joining them any moment. And there they are, first across the hatch, Mike Hopkins. And here's Victor Glover. You heard the crew here, uh, the team here on in Mission Control cheering to see them come, come across the hatch. There's Shannon Walker. And finally, Suichi Noguchi bringing up the rear. Four new members bringing the total Expedition 64 crew to a total of seven. Ready to uh, increase the space station science and, and get to work.